Hey guys, how's it going? Retro Prime here. Now I'm going to blast out a quick review of a toy that I've just recently got because I'm packing for my holidays. You know you can see some of the holiday bags there, the pink one being the wife's, not mine. Um, so I thought I'd knock out a very, very, even for me, a very quick review because I just want to get it done before I go away. And said figure we will talk about today is Titan's Return Perceptor. Eesh! This guy is absolutely fantastic. By far, by far the best Titan's Return figure I own. Now first off I'll say one thing, this is one of the slimmest and most kibble free, gap free, lovely tight jointed figures I own. It's just unbelievable. Such a thin profile and there's just no waste, it all looks absolutely lovely. Um, even his arms, I mean he's got the hollow bits where his hands fold didn't he? But that's like, oh, it's nothing compared to how beautiful the rest of the figure is. My favourite feature however is his head sculpt. It's not a feature, but you know, his, his favourite aesthetics is my his head sculpt because... Now, I'll not get this very well with the light, right, I'll do a retro Paul hand behind head action shot. There we go. Now, even the camera's not doing it justice to the naked eye, his, his, his cheeks are well defined and he, he has a very, very perceptory look. And it's just, what, oh, it's just a fantastic head sculpt. Plus his eyes, the yellow eyes, I've always liked that yellow eyed robots. Don't know why, I just do, but... It appeals to me very much. Now paint apps are few and far between, but like the plastic's different coloured enough that it doesn't matter. Like he's, he's, he is varied in colour, so he's got like red, uh, red, blue, what do you call it? Plastic, that'll be it. Red plastic, blue plastic, black plastic. But you've got Autobot symbol there on his tummy. Some of the silver detailing for the his alt mode, and then he's got sticker detail. Is it sticker detailing? No, yeah, I think it's topiographed, I'm not even sure what that means. But it's stuck on shit there that we fall off. Other than that, there's not a lot of paint. But he doesn't need it. Of course, he comes with his microscope attachment, because that's essentially what it is, a bloody microscope. It has loads and loads of sort of posability, shall we say. It can be just perceptor on the shoulder style. It's on this sort of sliding hinge. That means it can be slidden along, because this is for transformation obviously. But if you pull his headmaster off, oh, if you pull his fucking head off, come on you bastard, there we go. You can give him the old, I fear the wounds are fatal. Or is it too severe, I can't remember. Anyway, but so he's got that attachment, which is lovely, and it actually has. A wee bit of functionality there. It has got strength, sort of focused glass, but I doubt you can actually use it as a microscope. I've not tried. Nothing small enough to look at, if you know what I mean. Comes with this Titan's Return dude sitting gun rifle thing that doesn't really work. I don't like these weapons, they look crap. Although he's got the rest on it, which gives it a little bit sort of extra detail in it, and it doesn't actually look too bad in his hands. So for the first time with one of these weapons, I actually think it suits the, the toy, which is quite handy. And there's his alt mode. Looks very cool, just looks like Perceptor. Transformation is, it's got a couple of neat twists, but it's pretty much just fold his arms up, fold his legs in front of him, bend his knees, bend his feet, and he's a microscope. Um, like I said, it has got the old functionality, but you can't see anything through it. Um, no, more, no more revealed paint apps in this mode, it just looks very much like Perceptor. Um, as someone on Twitter pointed out, James, he looks like he's looking into a... <laughs> was it James? I can't remember. I think it was. Looking into a takeaway tray there, examining his Friday night Chinese. He's like, oh, I wonder where this is. Oh, Christ. I nearly dropped him then. So, alt mode is pretty much what you'd expect. And it does the job. So there you go. Titan's Return Perceptor. The best Titan's Return figure I own. Lovely face sculpt. Lovely colours. Tight joints. Tight legs. Transformation's not that tight. When he, I mean, he pegs his legs peg in the sides but they don't really work but it's not like you're going to be driving a bit he just sits on the desk doesn't he so it doesn't really matter uh, other than that he's just fucking beautiful that's all I can say if you can find him in your shops or even if you can find him online online just fucking buy him because he is absolutely fantastic um, you will have no regrets whatsoever anyway so that was my quick review um, I hope you enjoyed it if you did please like comment and subscribe you'll find buttons and the like down there for doing such a thing um, yeah, I shall be sunning it in Spain for the next two weeks, so while I'm doing so, I wish you all love and happiness and, uh, you know, just good vibes, dudes. Eesh.